Shit. Reporting for duty. What's the plan? What's the plan? Move them over there. Tell me what to do. What's that? Once I get my my place built, I'm fine. Shit. <laughs> What's the plan? You're building that city. Oh I'm gonna leave my warrior in there. I'm gonna get a worker going. Obviously I've got some archers going for some bizarre reason, but the enemies can go. Uh, I'm going to leave them there, I think, and fortify them. Um, so we've got what we got. We've got. I see I'm losing some gold, but we'll we'll get gold in a minute. Um, so, where, where's my borders gone to? There, cool. I need to build a road. It is entirely seemly for a young man killed in battle to lie mangled by the bronze spear. In his death, all things appear fair. Sorry about that. Oh, right, okay. Alright, let's go for it. Let's get some slavery going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Revolution! My God. Oh yeah, because because we're now revoluting. Uh, this is going to take years, years to build. That leads to man to literature. Oh, let's have sailing, and then I can I can have something then. Because I got, oh yes, I got that. I, I don't know though. I think my boat will appear. Well, there they are. Five turns. Uh, what I'm going to do is, when my arch is built, they're going to go roaming around. Let's have a look. It's not really barbarians. I've got them bloody lions poodling around. Right, so we've got my archers. Uh, we will eventually have archers in, in. But I'm going to go and have a wander around. And I'm going to build my road. And connect my two cities. What's wrong with that? See, my people are unhappy, you can tell. They're unhappy. So... Because they're unhappy, I don't know what you do to do that. We demand military protection, so they want military protection, basically. Um. Okay, so we need we need to build some arches. I'm gonna. <sighs> right, and that doesn't remove the tile, just so you know. <laughs> oh no, I'm there. Gonna work the hopeless. Excellent. 
You can't direct the wind, but you can adjust your sails. I'm going to put them back in there actually to be honest, I'm going to send Your these orders. guys out. See they're happy now, now I'll put them in there. Okay, so we've got ivory. Oh, right, so although I build camps, I've still got to connect the ivory to my main city. Ah, that's not what was in, um, in the other ones. That's, that's, that's cool. Well, it's a, oh, and can I change this gold business? I'm I'm losing gold big time here. How do I get into that thing? Okay, so the research was 100%, but now it's 90%. I'm going to get three gold per turn, or two gold per turn. I need I need gold, otherwise I yeah, I can't build anything. Out of my language. All right, let's go for it. Oh yes. I know I can have a camp. I want to connect my two cities together. I'm going to concentrate on a couple of buildings on here first and then I'll uh, get another settler going because I want the settler... Oh, I can't point to it. Uh, I want the settler to... Let me have a look. I want it down here. Well, there's not much down here to be honest. Oops, sorry. But I'm curious what's over here. What am I looking at here? Oh, that guy there. So quite a lot of uh, thingies, you know. I think there's quick keys you can press, but I'm not sure what those are. Obviously, the uh, research means is dropping down, so this will drop down because I wanted to get some more gold. Okay, so looking here, this would be pretty boring because all I've got is some rice and nothing else. So, uh, up there is probably no good. They're going to expand across. That's expanding quite bigly, actually. Oops, sorry. Um, bigly, is that a word? That's going to connect to that, that's fine. So, maybe something over here, I don't know. And maybe something down there where I've got my incense, I don't know. 
Uh, okay, we've got my worker at last. So uh, we're going to try and build something that's a bit easy. Yeah. If you play uh, Civilizations 5, that's the monument from what I can gather. Okay. Let no. Those look like they only take one turn, which is a lot quicker than Civ 5. I think that's like a lot longer. Uh, so let's get a mining. Let's do some gold. Gold. Not sure, but is that another civilization there? Is that Germany? I see it's Germany. Wonderful. So that's that ruined. Um, I can't really go there, so I'm going to have to go down there, I think. Tending to the crops already. Tending to the crops of, that's not theirs. Well, that's a slow moving game. Oh. If in other sciences we should arrive at certainty without doubt and truth without error, it behooves us to place the foundations of knowledge in mathematics. It's a different game compared to uh, Civs, f Civs 5, because Civs 5 there's a lot more going on, and it seems to be a lot quicker to this. Um, but, you know, uh, you're yeah, your first in the share resources. Awesome. Right, well, we need to get him back there, don't we? We don't want him messing around there. And, and of course, that means you go quicker. <laughs> That's why you want cities with um, those. Oh! Is that... Wh where's their land? I can't see it. I mean, is it this... Well, oh. a good eye for detail if you can see it. Build a camp and get some ivory. like a nice cottage there. Kind of highlights what you can or what you you suggested to do. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm gonna see if I can I can get any sort of trades with the iron in a minute. Ivory I mean. Ooh! Ah This is what we don't get on Civs 5. So basically, what that what I was oohing on arming for is when you play Civs Five and you build Stonehenge, you just get a picture. You get this picture coming up in front of the screen, going, "You built Stonehenge." It's like, yeah, well, yeah, great. I mean, there's, I don't know. That I think is quite a nice thing. Uh, well, we can have pyramids if we really want it, or we can have an aqueduct and get um, the health. And I think that'll probably help my team. My team. I can't... Oh, what? Oh yeah, because I've got a free obelisk. Uh, so, we can have a... Oh, God. Well, we need to... Yeah, we need to grow. What's that? Gems? So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get a settler. Where am I going? That's going to be all mine in a minute, isn't it? That would be nice. So I have, what we got, gold, gold and pigs. Horses. So I can't see from my angle. Whoa, I'm not used to going out that far. Um, there's some rice over there. And pastures. I don't know. I don't know. If I was over here, I'd have to have it here. Here, maybe on the on the la on the on the thing there. Yeah. 
Okay, let's try a trade deal. Oh, pardon that weird noise, that's my um, <laughs> phone if you heard it. Something, something messes up nearly half eleven. Yeah, he's actually talking about this game blue or not. Uh, so uh, we've 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 done our little camp. Uh, what else can we do? We can build a road. Apparently, let's build a road. You probably know I'm playing at this moment in time. I was in their borders. Well, well, well. Oh yeah, yeah, because I've got these outside doesn't mean anything. You've got to protect them within the actual city itself. I don't know why I'm building a road there. It doesn't make any sense. Oh, it's a hamburger zooming on over. So I really need that cellar. Oh. I used to go in this far out. Well, how far have they got to go before they've completed the aqueduct? There's my bear barriers zooming around. Bloody hell, no! Sod. Ready for action. Oh wait, I've just lost a bloody worker. <sighs> That's why I need some s I need some people in my borders, don't I? This is ridiculous. That's great, but I now have no workers. But I tell you what, I'm gonna put them there. I need a worker. I'll send him down there. 